but the coach is here. If you want to speak with him. Oh yeah, or like with coach, yeah. Okay. Wow. Bonjour, guten Tag. What's up, bruv? Guys, what a beautiful day where there's no time to waste. You guys might be wondering in which country am I? I'm not gonna tell you until later on, but we are currently at a bus stop because we're waiting for our bus because it's going straight to the club. And the good thing is because today is Saturday, so there are friendly matches going on. And the club, which I'm thinking to go to, they actually play a friendly match against another team. I'm not gonna say against which division because then you guys might wonder and you guys gonna start to Google and stuff like this, no. So it's literally a friendly match and it's literally two clubs in one location. And this is good for me because I can approach two clubs at the same time. It's gonna be 30 minutes bus drive which is not too much but we haven't slept in the bus okay i slept maybe one or two hours i'm so tired what i am thinking is if i show up to that club and then i get to speak to someone what if they say okay listen we have a match so play that match just in case I brought my football shoes with me. I'm tired, I haven't slept. Like, am I prepared? No, but in life, you always have to be prepared. So that's why we're just gonna close our eyes and just go through it because it's a once in a lifetime opportunity, maybe. But before it comes that they invite me to a match, we first need to get there. We first need to like see someone that we can speak to and fingers crossed, but hopefully all goes well. But this country, I have to say, is really beautiful. Really beautiful. It's just different than, for example, Romania. Because here, people are not looking at me weird. Like, it's just different vibes. Completely different vibes. Here, people are also very welcoming. I don't get those stares that I get, for example, in Romania. And I actually thought I'm gonna get stares. But it's not at all. And I actually saw other black people as well. And you might... Think why does he always keep talking about black people this I mean if you're black you know and in six foot six you know for me those kind of things are just important like if I'm in a country if I feel good if I feel that I'm that I'm welcomed here because if you get sometimes those stares like in Romania and like sometimes you just don't feel nice you just don't feel welcome but anyway enough talking straight to the action Sorry, sorry, one question. Uh, is there any sport director or something? I don't know. His office or like inside? Yeah. Okay. Hey, my friend. Hello. Do you know um, the sport director? Yes. Do you know his office? Uh, his office? Yes, I think he is around here. Yes, I think he's here. Yeah, you, you want to know his name? Uh, no, but I... Okay. The office is upstairs, but maybe he's here. Yeah. Maybe he's here. Oh, you know Ivo is here? Yeah, I'll check. Go, go upstairs 
seconds. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Brandon, and I play professional football in, uh, from Germany and, uh, and I was looking for a club because me I play I don't and how many how many years you play uh -huh. and I play centre back professional I have transferred my everything your is was the what? my last cup is in Romania which club uh, Panduri Karguji Panduri yes you know Panduri yes I know oh okay yeah, and I played uh, like 20 matches and stuff. Uh, and video. Write me my, uh, my and send me your no, your name. Yeah, okay, perfect. Wait, so, at least, thank God, I got the sports director's number and he said to send him my profile from Transfermarkt and also my videos, how I play. And also, he knew the club Panduri, which is just like, wow. Wow, I mean, Panduri has such a like big history that actually other countries they know Panduri, but they're gonna have a match now, and I actually hope that they're not gonna play a good good match and maybe concede one two goals because then the manager or the sports director might think, okay, maybe we should give him a chance. He should maybe we maybe he strengthens our defense so you never know but i was thinking i could watch that game because he he said that i can stay and watch the game but there is another team that plays in the same division and they're gonna have a match as well against another team so that's why what is good i can go to the other match as well and ask both teams because now as I got his number, I'm sorted and I just hope that something comes out of it. But I think it's better if I go to the other match because then I might have three clubs in just one day done. And if all of them say no, at least I know and we can move on. Sorry, my friend. Sorry. Hola. Sport director. Raiko. Райко търсиш или кой? А? Кое е име? Райко. Чакаш го тука. Няма го още. А, е камин? Ще дойде. А, окей, окей. Кажи ли приятелче? Плащата на Веко Петлова, какво да беше? Аз ще ти дам, ама ти какво иска. Imagine, just imagine, wow. And there's even TV station as well. Wow, just imagine, just imagine. Wow. You wait uh, for like? Yes. But about uh, what? About, um, because I play football. Uh, but the coach is here. If you want to speak with him, Oh yeah, or like with coach, yeah. Okay, come. Oh, hello. 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 Because uh, um, I play um, centre back, and I play professional, yeah. and I have transfer marked everything, and I was thinking. Um, if I can get a trial or something, because I played um, in Romania 
Yeah, I, I was training there till now, so that's why I'm fit. And um, yeah, so I just wanted to speak to someone and... Yes, yes, but the like with, um, no reason to, to, to ask him something. Um, but we don't uh, look for the terms, understand that? Oh, okay. Um, we are not interested. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah okay. If maybe try another thing, they... Yeah. What you are from? I'm from Germany. Are you in Germany? Yeah, I was, I'm from Germany, yes. And when you played play before? Uh, in Panduri, Romania, just Panduri. last season, yeah. yeah. This is the second? Panduri. Yeah, second division, yeah. yeah. Or maybe if I ask the team you play against? Uh, maybe if you ask someone there. Yeah, because, because me, I just, I just want to play football. This is the now, that's the, the letter, it's the second division. Oh, and okay. You cannot have the foreigners there. Ah, okay. in second division you yes. don't have foreigners. Now, now the new rules from the federation, they stop the foreigners. They will play in second division only with Bulgarians. Oh, okay. In the first division. Maybe, maybe here in the, in Sofia have more uh, two, three teams. You can try. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Okay, but second division you second, can't. No, you cannot go there. Ah, okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay. That's good to know. Okay, so unfortunately with this club, it's not working out because they don't need center back. But I just found out, but, and I see the stadium and everything, this is like literally the biggest club in Bulgaria. Like literally the biggest because there's Ludo Goretz and this one but the manager proposed me to try it actually in other clubs in other teams and he said as well that in the second division there are no foreigners allowed anymore they changed the rules so that's why I always say nothing in life you do for nothing even when you travel 12 13 hours to a club and you hear no I mean to hear a no is still something because then you know that okay there is not working out so nothing in life is for nothing. So that's why the manager still invited me to, to see the match, which I'm gonna do. And I see the fans already there. So I'm really excited to see them play, how they play Bulgarian football. First time that I see that. And let's see how it's going to be. Imagine to play here. Imagine actually to play here. Very nice stadium. Very, very nice stadium. And I'm so excited to see the level, literally, because the blue team, first division, them one, second division. So I really want to see how they play, like the level. Passion, passion, guys. Passionate. I love that, mate.
day done here in Bulgaria Sofia and even though the results were not what we were expecting but we keep going we keep going I know it's not going to be easier but I just have hope and faith that it's gonna like something is going to come really like really i just hope that but tomorrow is another day where there are other clubs that actually can welcome me because i'm gonna just go and show up because that's how you do it and i don't have any contacts but i don't want to have any excuses because as long as i have my faith god and two healthy feet i can do that but Thanks again for all the support. Team Brandao, you guys are unbelievable. So I really want to thank you. And hopefully this country is good to us because I actually like it. First day here, you walk around through the city and the people are actually very nice. And it's actually nice. It's a nice country. So all Bulgarians out there, you guys have a nice country. Like, I mean, for me being here one day like yeah but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed watching today's video make sure you subscribe if you haven't already smash that like button guys and keep in mind when you believe everything is possible so team run down i'll see you tomorrow Thank <laughs> you.